Be right here. It was Tuesday, December the 3rd, 1974. Eric Johnson and a friend were running low on supplies and trapped high in the Smokies. He's here today because of the hard work and dedication of Smoky Mountain Rangers that day. Each year, Johnson's mother stops by to thank them for their efforts. And this year, for the first time, Eric came too. Stephen McLam has this story. Oh, well, surreal. That's the description that Eric had after arriving today while looking back at facing possible death here 35 years ago. Juanita Johnson brings a poinsettia every December 3rd to National Park Headquarters to thank the Rangers for saving her son 35 years ago. It's so uh, clear in my mind what the Rangers did for Eric. And it was scary, very scary. But for the first time since 1974, Eric Johnson was the one bringing the flowers. It's very gratifying and uh, to know that... Uh, that they remember uh, what happened 35 years ago. Johnson told a group gathered at Park Headquarters the story of how he went on a three-day hike with a friend, Randy Laws, on the Appalachian Trail at the age of 15, but stopped early at a shelter because of snow. The next morning... We tried to hike out on Sunday, but the snow was just too deep. Uh, we were unable to see the actual trail markers. So for three days, they rationed food in sub-freezing temperatures. A former ranger remembers they tried to get to the boys by snowmobiles, but they couldn't. It was inevitable that we wasn't going to make it, and they sent the helicopter looking for them. Thanks to a red backpack. And also, I had uh, stamped out the letters H-E-L-P in the snow. Uh, in 20 foot high letters. The boys were found. It was incredible. I'd never seen it that large of a helicopter in my life. After three days in the snow and a couple days in the hospital, Johnson recovered. Eric's mother says the thanks will continue despite what naysayers have to say. All of these years there won't be any flowers. Well, there will. There will always be flowers. As long as Eric's alive. Well, as far as hiking, Eric still likes the extreme. A couple years after that event, he started hiking to summits of the mountains, but Mark and Allison, he's very thankful for what the Rangers did 35 years ago. Plans to keep on bringing them flowers every year. Such has a great a, story. Has a, has a life to thank them for, doesn't he? Yeah. Absolutely. All right, good stuff. Thank you.